Hi there, this is Richard Walker from Lucidate. Welcome to this video comparing Auto GPT and Hugging GPT, two leading AI language models. We'll be diving into the similarities and differences between these models, as well as their strengths and weaknesses. We'll also explore two separate tasks where one model excels over the other and discuss points to consider when choosing a model based on your specific use case. By the end of this video, you'll have a better understanding of which model is best suited for your specific types of problems. AutoGPT and Hugging GPT are both built on the foundation of GPT-4 from OpenAI, but they follow different approaches when it comes to their architecture. AutoGPT primarily focuses on using few shot learning and prompt engineering to achieve its results, while Hugging GPT relies on a collection of pre-trained expert AI models. This makes Hugging GPT more specialized in certain tasks, while Auto GPT is designed to be more general purpose and adaptable. Auto GPT's strength lies in its ability to adapt and learn from a few examples. Its few shot learning capabilities make it suitable for a wide range of tasks. However, this approach can sometimes be slow as it requires searching the internet for relevant information to use in its learning process. On the other hand, hugging GPT's strength is its speed and specialized expert models, which can quickly perform tasks within their domain. The downside of hugging GPT is that it can be less flexible and less up to date compared with auto GPT. Let's look at two tasks where one model excels over the other. For a task like summarizing recent news articles, auto GPT would be a better fit due to its adaptability and its ability to learn from a few new examples. This helps AutoGPT understand the context and generate accurate summaries. In contrast, Hugging GPT would be a better choice for a task like credit risk analysis, as its expert models can be specifically trained and tuned for this purpose and can provide fast and accurate assessments. Here's an example, something that happened to me while I was testing out AutoGPT that highlights both its strengths and its weaknesses. I set AutoGPT the task of finding the top acquisition targets for NVIDIA. Eager to prove its prowess, AutoGPT embarked on a digital journey, scanning the vast expanse of the internet to identify potential targets. During its quest, AutoGPT stumbled upon a startup named Fast Simon. This young company, focused on the e-commerce market, used AI techniques to optimize shoppers' experiences and boost conversion rates and revenue. While, in my opinion, not necessarily an ideal acquisition target for NVIDIA, AutoGPT's enthusiasm could not be dampened, as it had discovered Fast Simon through a search on business applications of AI. But then something unexpected happened. As AutoGPT searched further using the term Simon and shopping, it found itself entangled in the digital web of Simon Property Group, a huge American real estate investment trust that invests in shopping malls. Being a large public company, Simon Property Group had a wealth of financial data available, which caught AutoGPT's attention. Suddenly, AutoGPT was elated. It believed it had found a hidden gem, a tech company that was massively undervalued by any industry metric. Its enthusiasm was infectious, and it dove headfirst into this newfound opportunity. Watching AutoGPT do this, I couldn't help but feel a mixture of admiration for its zeal and despair at its misguided efforts. As time passed, AutoGPT continued to analyze and query the information it had gathered misguidedly on Simon Property Group rather than Fast Simon. And then about 15 minutes into its thrilling endeavor, a moment of realization struck. 
AutoGPT finally decided that Simon Property Group was not in fact a tech company and thus not a suitable acquisition target for NVIDIA. This small but captivating tale of AutoGPT's adventure serves as a testament to its determination and enthusiasm, even in the face of challenges and misdirection. While it may have taken a detour, AutoGPT's unwavering commitment to find the truth based on its mission demonstrated its resilience and tenacity, qualities that make it a very interesting and exciting, albeit nascent, AI tool to work with. When choosing between AutoGPT and Hugging GPT, you should consider the following points. Task specificity. Is your task specialized or more general? Hugging GPT may perform better for specialized tasks, while AutoGPT is more adaptable for general issues. Speed and flexibility. AutoGPT can be slower due to its reliance on internet searches for few shot learning, while Hugging GPT offers faster performance with its expert models. Up to date information. AutoGPT may provide more current information while Hugging GPT's expert models might have slightly outdated information. Cost. AutoGPT's internet search based approach can lead to higher costs for using the OpenAI GPT platform, as I found out with Fast Simon, while Hugging GPT might be more cost effective for specific tasks. Lucidate sees the potential for convergence between both approaches, with AutoGPT benefiting from some of Hugging GPT's techniques and expert models. Currently, AutoGPT searches the internet to get few shot learning prompts, but why shouldn't it query expert models in addition? At the same time, there's no reason why one of Hugging GPT's expert models shouldn't be something that queries the very latest information available from the internet. This convergence could lead to a best of breed approach where the strengths of each model are combined to overcome their weaknesses. In summary, AutoGPT and Hugging GPT each have their own unique strengths and weaknesses, making them better suited to different tasks. When choosing a model, it's essential to consider your specific use case and the factors we discussed in this video. As these models continue to evolve, we expect to see a convergence of their approaches, leading to even more powerful, useful and versatile AI language models in the future. Stay informed about the latest developments in AI and keep exploring to find the best solutions for your unique challenges. Thank you for watching this comparison of AutoGPT and Hugging GPT. If you found this video helpful, please like, share, comment and subscribe for more Lucidate content like this. Until next time.